I feel like you are gonna love today today's drill, guys. It's so much fun in my opinion. And every time I teach this drill to one of the kids I teach, they love it. It's so much fun. And I will explain you why right now, okay? Now, before that, make sure you go Instagram, follow us there. We're posting daily stories. We're answering to all your messages. Okay, so go there, shoot us a message if you have any kind of questions and check our daily stories because we're helping you out on how to get better now that you are staying at home. Now, let's get into a drill. Here's the way the drill works. I'm going to be playing points against Sergey from the baseline. Okay, just regular points. We can do whatever we want. But as soon as one ball bounces inside of the service box, the player receiving that short ball needs to call short, and both players need to go up and play only inside of the service boxes. Let me explain it to you again. So we're just rallying, okay? Let's say Sergey's ball bounces here on the service box, right? I'm gonna go, I'm gonna call short, and after that, the court gets limited to the service boxes. So I can do whatever, but my ball needs to bounce on his service boxes, and his ball needs to bounce on my service boxes, okay? So from there on, you can do whatever you want. You can work on your drop shot. You can maybe go for a few angles. You can hit as hard as you want, okay? As long as the ball bounces instead of the service box, okay? So there are different strategies you can use here. Maybe you can move the other one with some angles. Maybe you can hit a short and low slice and come in so the other one doesn't have many angles to pass you there, okay? So today we're working a lot in touch, okay? We're going to be working a lot of touch and improve the touch on those balls so you can start improving maybe your angles, maybe your drop shots, you know, like this kind of thing. So let's get into it. So make sure you practice this drill, guys. It's so much fun. You could say that we had a few two energy. You know, I hit the first one, then Sergey got a little bit mad. You know, he's like, "Oh, I'm gonna do it to you." He ended up doing it. Unfortunately, I mean, it was it was a pretty good twinner there. Practice it. There are, again many variables that you can do. You could be doing this with only one box if you don't want to run as much. You could do it with a box across from you. You could go with the cross uh, with a box down the line, or you could even do this drill on half court down the line or cross court. Okay, there are so many variables that we could add to a drill, but. Uh, Again, it's so much fun and it's a great drill to practice your touch game, okay?